You're heading outside for a walk or maybe trail days this weekend. Yes. Uh, it's going to be beautiful. There's actually an event that the city of Greensboro is putting on at Country Park on Saturday from 9 to noon uh, where they'll have guided hikes, biking, music, a whole lot of fun things going on over there on Saturday. And the weather will be great for it this weekend, whether you're heading to trail days in Greensboro or out to the foothills. Really nice weather just all around and, and it's a treat this time of year to have some low humidity and nice comfortable temperatures outside. Those puffy cumulus clouds are developing across the area this afternoon, a sign that we are in for a nice day of weather. Warming up to 74 right now in Troy. Burlington's at 73, 71 Greensboro and High Point, and then into the 60s off in the North Carolina mountains as you head up in elevation just a bit. But still, it's a comfortable day regardless because of this cold front that moved through yesterday. So we have the northwesterly winds bringing in some cooler and drier air uh, with this area of high pressure, really keeping much of the eastern U.S. high and dry and nice and calm for the next couple days at least. So later this afternoon, our average high is 81. We'll be a little bit more mild than that today down into the upper 70s. So a bit below average, but really comfortable with the lower humidity, just some passing clouds. Then we get into the 60s and 50s later on tonight once the sun sets. Mid 70s likely for the foothills later this afternoon and up in the high country. Again, a bit more on the mild side with temperatures slightly below average in the upper 60s, but still it's a comfortable day with a nice northwesterly breeze and lower humidity. So can't ask for much more than that. Maybe looking for something to do on your Thursday night, 635 first pitch rockers versus Charleston there uh, in high point, a nice comfortable evening. But again, if you're heading out to a baseball game later on, you may want a sweatshirt because It'll be a cooler night outside the dash. Also have a game later against the Hickory Crawdads. First pitch at 7 o'clock there. So it's a warm afternoon, but later this evening we really start to cool down. One of our coolest nights we've had in quite some time. I wouldn't be surprised if the mountains and foothills, a couple outlying places, drop down into the 40s tonight. But most of us in the triad waking up to low to mid 50s later on our Friday morning. So consider wearing a light jacket or maybe having a, a hoodie with you on your way to work tomorrow just in case you need it. Over the weekend, we'll be warming up those 80s return and by Sunday we have the chance of a stray shower, but it's really not looking like much. Uh, the more summertime weather returns Monday and Tuesday of early next week. As you see, uh, we'll start to bring that moisture flow back in from the south as our wind direction shifts. You see that humidity returning to much of the eastern U.S. Uh, uh, Monday and into Tuesday. That's when we also bring in a low chance of a shower or storm beginning Sunday, but Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday looking like we have better rain chances, but it'll be scattered each day. Not really looking like one day is a washout, but going forward when that heat and humidity returns early next week, we'll have to keep our eye on a couple of rain chances as well. So here's our seven day forecast. Nice weather really through the weekend, feeling nice and comfortable outside. Lots of sunshine and lower humidity, low chance of rain returns Sunday into Monday and a better chance for rain and storms Tuesday and Wednesday of next week.